Hello everybody, this is Peyton McDonald. Um, <clears throat> in this video, um, <clears throat> we're going to be looking at a pretty cool toy, I think. <clears throat> it's pretty basic, but it's good at what it does. <clears throat> um, so this is an electronic toy saxophone. I don't think it has an actual name. <laughs> Uh, but it was made by, I'm not sure, either Redbox or Small World Toys. I did an eBay uh, image search and it came up with something um, from a company called Small World Toys, which looks exactly like this. There was two versions of it, one that had 18 songs and one that had 20. <clears throat> one of them had buttons that were slightly different uh slightly different colors and then apparently uh i had somebody read the bottom of the battery cover and apparently this one is from red box toys and apparently there's two versions of that one as well one with 18 and one with 20 songs this one has 20 but there's one out there that says it has 18 so I don't know if they're just getting the numbers wrong or if they're two different versions. Um, but I'll kind of describe it. Uh, so starting at the end, there's this blue thing that looks like it could be like the mouth thing. It doesn't really do anything, though. Um, on the, like, right below that, on the on that side, there's a, there's a small button. It stops it if it's playing a song and it lets you play the other four notes of the octave uh, when you're playing with the other buttons. So on the opposite side, kind of on the inside of the toy, there's four buttons going down this side. You can play those like yeah, each one plays a different note. So there's uh, the first four uh, notes and you hold down the button with these other with the, the other four buttons to play the, uh, the rest of it. Kind of above where that's at, you have a three position switch all the way up towards the top is off. Uh, sliding it down one is low volume and sliding it all the way down is high volume. So let's turn it on. I turned it up. Uh, so now it's on high volume. You know what? We'll keep it on low. Um, and then below the power switch, a few inches down, there's four buttons that are different colors. When you press these... What? Apparently this thing is a little more glitchy than I remember. Because it just froze up. Okay. <laughs> they make different sounds. And they have lights in them as well. And then to the right of that button on the bottom is the button that goes through the songs. So let's go through these these other ones. So like I said, you can... And you hold down the button on the back. Oops. Um... So yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, oh, the battery compartment is on the bottom, kind of where it curves. And the speaker is uh, inside of the... Is in the end, there's a big hole at the end. And that's where the speaker is. So, uh, let's look at the music mode. So it'll start playing a song. If you want to stop it, you hit the button. If you hit one of the other buttons, one of the buttons that play the different notes, um, it'll let you play the song. It doesn't matter which one you press. And then it's done. So I'm going to turn it off and back on 
Now let's go through all the sounds. I wish I could, uh, I haven't found the test mode yet. It doesn't do much with low batteries, just resets and the lights get darker. Um, and I don't have a pickup coil, so I can't get high quality recordings. I'd love to get one though, I might. I've been thinking about that for quite a while. I wanna get one. Oh, it beeps every few seconds if you don't mess with it. So here we go, second one. You know what? Never mind. I don't think I'll do all the, song, all the songs in this video because I want to make a video that I can listen to as well. And sometimes I just like to listen to all these songs. I don't know if I'll, I, you know, I, I don't really have access to this uh, too often. So I, I want to get a good recording of all the songs. Um, so I think I'll save that for another video. But yeah, that's that, that's it. That is, uh, oh, and this came out in 2002, if I didn't mention that. It takes two double A's uh, in the bottom. And the interesting thing about this is that both batteries go in the same way, which you don't see very often. But yeah, that's that's about it. It doesn't do that much, but like I said, it it's still pretty cool. It's good at what it does. Yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching, and I will see you all next time.